Korean Quilt. Hey everybody, welcome back to Korean Quilt. That's right, your guide to the Korean language and culture. Anna, do you remember what we learned on the show two days ago? Sure. 결혼했어요? Are you married? And do you recall what we learned yesterday? 아직요? Not yet. Exactly. And today we're going to take this line of thinking one step further. Let's pretend someone we know is getting married. Okay, can you do that, Anna? Okay. Pretend, pretend. Okay, okay. I'll okay. pretend. Now, do you know what a wedding is called in Korean? Uh, isn't it just 결혼? Ooh, Anna, wonderfully sweet and naive and pure and innocent. Anna, you're translating from the English literally. In Korean, you need to attach one more character at the end, which is 식, which means ceremony, and you get wedding, or quite literally, wedding ceremony, 결혼식. So does that mean that an engagement party or a stag and doe, as the case might be with some people, would be a 약혼식? You've got it. Now, what we're going to say is I'm going to to a wedding. Remember that kada is the verb to go, so when we put it with our new vocabulary, we get 결혼식에 가요. I'm going to a wedding. 결혼식에 가요. Or, we were just talking about an engagement party, 약혼식. Our phrase becomes, I'm going to an engagement party. 약혼식에 가요. What about going over those a couple of times? First, I'm going to a wedding. 결혼식에 가요. Right, or a little slower here. 결혼식에 가요. And then I'm going to an engagement party. 약혼식에 가요. 약혼식에 가요. Excellent. Wonderful, Richard. So that's it for today. Thanks for joining us. We'll be back tomorrow with lots more here on Korean Quilt. Bye.